Welcome back. So, could you go ahead, please, and make your point? Yeah, yeah. So, so if we really want to get to credible elections, very easy. Why I said it's very easy, even with what we have, is with the electronic system of verification, we get to that stage. The law provides that you announce results at every stage of collection openly. What stops us from recording these announced results? Video recording these announced results. So you, you mean with, with how? No, you, you, you video record at, it. Yes, at the first stage, you allow the agents to with their phones or whatever. Okay, with device, the phone device. Yes, with the phone device or any other video device. Is there any law that stops them? There is no law that stops them. But the security agencies will not allow them, especially when they get to the wholesale oh. region. Mm -hmm. Immediately after the the first stage that is the collation at the polling booth when they now start aggregating the votes or the collation from all the booths they will no longer allow them so you support that in this uh, amendments now that's go about to take place yes. they should also look at the possibility of allowing agents for instance yes. party agents yes. to have their phones and record the whole collation process yes. in the collation center yes with the media too if they are available to also record it that will a long way eliminate our problems because we will be clear it will be very clear who has won the election there will be video evidence of who has won the election so if you're now manipulating the system it becomes a problem i know that some people may say oh what of when somebody has manipulated a video recording if we now have electronic system or electronic um, evidence how to produce electronic evidence in courts are we still afraid of manipulating? After all, paper things, people have been manipulating it. Mm -hmm. Which one is easier to manipulate? Is it the paper, the paper thing, or the electronic? Remember that both of them are going uh, in, in Paris mm -hmm. So there will be paper trail, there will be video trail, there will be voice audio trail. So where are we going to get it wrong as we are moving? This is also complex if you have to begin to put in all these uh, checks and balances. Isn't there just one stop simple way to just press on a button and everything is just okay? That cannot be manipulated. Yes. That virus cannot attack. When you look at electronic voting, you see that it is also subject to manipulation. Because there can be virus attack, there can be electric failure, electric, you know, there can be <laughs> power failure, there can be so many things that can be there. So that does not stop us from going for all those ones. But we need a paper trail at this stage of our development in what we are doing. If you don't have a paper trail, any person can manipulate the system along the road. So the paper trail should back up the electronic should voting Should back up system. the electronic voting if you want to do electronic voting. So I would expect them to, while saying, yes, INEC can introduce electronic voting. However, there should be paper trail that will help us confirm the credibility of the election process because if there is a allegation you know of the process the courts can order for a recount if you have electronic somebody is in in custody of the recount system but if it's a paper trail if there is a paper trail following it means a third party can look at what you have done but i thought that the, the amendment that the senate did I think this, the, there was a little bit of uh, focus on that, wherein no agency or no one should impede uh, uh, the party agents from the collation centers or around. I think there was something in that respect. That, that would be a good one if the House of Reps follow in the same footsteps. Oh, yes, that would be a good one. But I think also that after, after that, if INEC would, but if you say nobody should impede, yes, depends also on the interpretation of that section if you stop them from recording yes or having access to the collision yes that goes against the grains of that particular clause but that's something that it means that we must interpret it to or get they, to they that spell it out too uh, sometimes it's good to spell <laughs> it out that it can be recorded you know that every person media houses should be allowed into mm -hmm. it upon accreditation because in nigeria what the problem we have is that a lot of people look at a little loophole and they cash on it. If, for instance, we have a record in nobody, it's just like the reverse war, you know, electoral war. Nobody will be talking because everybody would have seen it. The trail will be there. 
you know, the things that was done at a particular time will be there. And people and um, part of our voter education will be the political parties should ensure the transparency of the process by recording each aspect of the process. So there is paper trail, there is recorded system, you know, and there is audio. Let me pick on uh, this very sensitive uh, process that everyone sees as such, which is women in politics or women inclusion in politics, which is one of the areas that uh, is being advocated for. How do you think this should 